welcome to my uh, video Planet Explorers and how to use the creation system to quickly make a car because you're probably on the storyline and you've been told you need to make a car and take a passenger this is the way to quickly build a car so you don't waste any resources experimenting yourself I'm in build mode for this so uh, first of all we have to select the kind of thing we're going to make this is going to be a small vehicle and now we select the parts from the parts list here they all are engines and wheels and so on now this little menu is very important it's rather hidden away in the bottom corner we're selecting the mirroring tool and we're going to select the X axis we can do everything really with the mirroring tool on now that the mirroring tool is on we're going to set uh, the drawing plane uh, because we don't want our engine scraping on the ground we're going to stick the cockpit in and grab an engine and pop that in in front as well at the moment because they don't uh, mirror those objects are just centered this is uh, the first mirroring I'm going to put two fuel packs in that just gives the car a bit more time between refueling and this is where the mirroring comes into its own we just dob a couple of wheels in and voila we have four wheels all nice and symmetric and just for completeness here I'm going to pop in a headlamp and if you're making this for the storyline you'll want to turn the mirroring off a moment and stick a seat on or, or maybe you want two passenger seats so that's the adjustment tool and it will adjust uh, again we need the mirroring on to adjust the mirrored pieces I'm giving a wide wheeled base to my vehicle so that it will negotiate the terrain well and this is the um, balancing tool here we're just going to put a little angling on there for the headlamps uh, and that's very nice now that's my car pretty complete but checking it over here in statistics I have two issues an error and a warning and the warning is that I've not put any steering wheels in so I'll tell the front two you have to tick and click apply it's a bit annoying and I like to make all four wheels steering wheels you get a, a better turning base in my opinion but that's all down to personal taste now we still have the error and the error is because well because we haven't actually put any material in our vehicle now we don't actually need to do any tedious drawing careful subframes or anything like that you can if you like and you can make an exceptionally good looking car mine is not going to be the best looking car by far and I've got loads of dirt and loads of marble as I'm sure you have too and I'm just going to use some marble and stick a big marble block in here now the marble block needs to be of a size this is probably larger than required you can get away with a smaller block the bigger the block the slower your car but the more durable it will be so it's a compromise the more material the slower but the more durable now uh, the car's ready all I have to do is select the save ISO uh, tool this is rather cool I can position up my object uh, on the bed just as I've been doing and I can get it just right to take a little image that will be used in my inventory and I can spend hours messing around getting exactly the right cool look for my icon there it is uh, I need to give my ISO a name demo car will do save that off and now the final tool from the little bottom right hand menu and we're going to um, export it now you need all these bits in your inventory already otherwise you have to go and collect them and make them and then you're ready you can export it and as soon as you've done that you can exit the uh, creator and there it is in the inventory simply drag it out and uh, drop it into the scene and there it is all we have to do is context click on the vehicle and we're offered the little menu and we get on there I am on the car and we take this for a little drive the car always turns to the direction you're looking at so you can use the mouse to steer the car by changing the direction you're looking in and you can use the keys but if you use the keys it will always turn back to the direction you're looking in right well we'll go for a little uh, speed test here 
um, just see what kind of speed we can get this car up to and I think we're ready to go and there we are it's pushing up to 40 45 slight up incline dropped it to about 35 and we're hitting a top speed of around about 50 so that's quite good we can get it up to 50 miles an hour on the, on relatively level terrain click L to turn the headlights on and off and now we'll go for a crash test to test durability so we'll push it up to around about 50 kilometers an hour and we'll just drive into that thing and whammo 99% still there on the left so that's great well thanks very much for watching my little video